All right, golfers, what's going on? Linksman here. I've got a fun drill slash common thing I see as I give lessons to a lot of students here at Linksman in Santa Ana. Um, it's very common for people to chicken wing or kink your lead trail, or sorry, your lead arm, your left arm. So if you're right-handed, your left arm. If you're left-handed, it's your other arm, your right arm. But what happens is we pull the club back I don't know what it is, but especially if you're relatively new to this game, even if you're not new, I was still doing this and that was like a five handicap. But as you pull the club back, most people bring the club inside, which causes this. And I'll look at, um, I'll look at you. So what happens is this arm kinks, and I've seen it as much as this. It's usually because you're probably an ex-baseball player. So if you think about a baseball swing as it's here, you're getting a ton of power, right? And so, it's hard to break that habit, but what I will tell you, this is a very easy drill. You just need two golf balls, just like that. This golf ball goes directly behind it. So what happens is a lot of people, I don't know why, it's just maybe because it's natural and very comfortable to bring the, the uh, club, arguably, they bring it to like that. So as I bring it this way, I mean, watch my left arm, like it, it legitimately has to kink and when this arm kinks like this, or chicken wings as it's called, it's a disaster. So you can do one of two things. If, you don't, if you're not a training aid person, which a lot of people are not training aid people, then what you do, focus on everything else I've been talking about, but really you just bring the, the club back to that ball, not this ball. And watch what happens. As I bring this club back, I'm going so far straight back that my left arm is forced to stay straight and then my right arm, which naturally bends. So watch. You see that? Like it, it literally can't bend. Now, if you're not, if that's not making sense, you can get at Roger Dunn or online, this band, Izzo, Izo, I don't really know how to pronounce it, but it pretty straightforward and simple. You're gonna just put it on both arms Put it on your biceps, not your elbows. Make sure this goes on your biceps. And this might mess up the uh, mic here, but it's okay. So this is now forcing me, I'm just gonna rest the club there for a second. It's forcing my arms to go in and creating kind of like a V. Let me just introduce the club here. So because it's compressing my arms together, like it's hard for me to be out here. It just naturally wants to go in. And because it's doing that, this is what also will help. And it feels weird if you're someone who chicken wings like a lot, this band is gonna feel really uncomfortable at first until you break that habit. This also promotes you bending your wrists, like kinking your wrists, which is really good for the swing. So I'd highly suggest either using this training aid or just simply bringing the club back out that way, not on the inside path. And I think you will see a dramatic difference in ball striking ability using this technique. So give that a shot, let me know how you do.